Now, your eyewitness weather forecast. Name Weather Rate's most accurate forecast since 2008. Well, good morning. We are being treated to plenty of sunshine right now after some patchy and dense fog this morning. And now we're just waiting for that temperature to climb up back near 90 again. It's going to happen for the next couple of days, actually. Here in Lehigh and at Lehigh and Area High School, there's plenty of sunshine, few patchy clouds, but that sun certainly going to be doing its job this afternoon. Temperatures are in the 70s and 80s, just in a few spots. Sealands Grove at 81, Pottsville 79, Mount Pocono at 76, and wilkes barre Scranton right around 73. In the Wyoming Valley, we're a little bit cooler just because we had some of that fog that was lingering, but eventually we'll watch that temperature continue to skyrocket. Dew points are in the 60s and 70s, so yeah, it's pretty humid as you're going outside, just like it was yesterday, just like it will be really for a majority of the rest of this week. We don't get any relief in that department until Friday. Radar's quiet, no rain showers right now. Later on today, there will be a pop-up shower or a thunderstorm, but we do have plenty of dry time today. Just keep an eye to the sky the later that we go into the afternoon. Temperatures are in the upper 80s to near 90 today. Then notice what happens this evening. It takes until around 8, 9 o'clock to drop out of the 80s and finally back into the 70s. And this is just the air temperature. Factor in that it's going to be very humid. It's actually going to feel at times like it's everywhere between the mid and even the upper 90s this afternoon. So remember those heat safety tips, but we are going to move away for a second and take a look at Tropical Storm Gordon, which is taking aim along the Gulf Coast. Currently is still a tropical storm with winds up to 65 miles per hour, gusting up to around 75 and moving to the northwest at just around 15 miles per hour. One big component we're taking a look at with this is the rain. Look at all of that torrential, heavy and steady rainfall that's starting to make its way onto the panhandle of Florida. All of this can continues to move up to the north and the west, taking aim at Alabama and Georgia. And because of that, we are watching for the potential for some flash flooding in some locations. Now, this is expected to continue to strengthen before it officially does end up making landfall. So here's where it is right now, just off the Gulf, Gulf, the Gulf Coast. But as we go later into today and closer to tonight, it is expected to make landfall right near Alabama as a Category 1 hurricane with winds up to 75 miles per hour, then continues to move up to the north and the west, eventually weakening to remnants before it turns up to the north and east. And that will happen later this week. And then we're actually going to look for the potential for some remnants to get here early next week. That's something we'll be watching, but we we'll give any updates on this as they become available. 90 today in the eyewitness weather forecast. Hazy, hot, humid, triple H today. A stray shower or thunderstorm that'll try to pop up later on. We're down near 70 tonight. It's warm. It is pretty muggy and there's an early shower or storm, but we should be pretty good for the most part. Tomorrow, it's a repeat day near 90 humid, a shower or storm, scattered showers and storms Thursday. That's ahead of a cold front. So behind that, we finally cool down. We also lose the humid air, but keep a shower or storm Friday and a few more showers Saturday, Sunday and into Monday. And you can always download the Eyewitness Weather app to get your latest updates on the weather. The interactive radar, good idea to have for the pop up shower or storm forecast available at PA homepage. Com. So the heat still here. It's and, and it's going to really stretch out this week. So the, this, the, even the fact that summer is unofficially over. Unofficially. Of course, we've got a couple more weeks of it, uh, but yeah, it's not it's not going anywhere. Not yet. Soon. Yes. All right, Stefano, thank you. A new.